otc-bitcoin.org, otc-bitcoin.org. We're going to do a fundamental analysis of NEO and ADEX, and for that matter, all China coins. Because people, you seem to have this idea that uh, it's just like America, China has a free market economy, and you can have this company and that company, and you can have this coin developer and that coin developer, and they can do their thing, and then if a dispute happens, it's kind of like Apple and Microsoft disputing uh, who, made, uh, who made their UI first, and both ripped off Xerox anyway, and then it goes to the Supreme Court, and then they fight. That doesn't happen in China. I'm going to explain that to you and show you the relationship between ADEX, NEO, and even Walton Coin, WTC, in a second, right now. This is our website, otc-bitcoin.org. If you need 24-hour fund management, click here. If you want to talk about OTC Bitcoin trading, if you want to contact us for large amounts of Bitcoin, click here. This is our website. And this is our free telegram room for Bitcoin secrets and signals. Okay, so this is what I've got to show you here. Okay, got it? All right, so here's the news. ADX, ADX becomes uh, the first DAP-based uh, coin on NEO. Okay, so ADX is working with NEO. That's pretty clear. Uh, this is on, well, this is a Medium post. Uh, let's look at the Merkle. The, I love the Merkle. Just a great report. Uh, partnership between ADX and NEO, Catapults, ADX, Exchangers. Partnership makes it sound like two different separate entities decided, hey, well, there's kind of a synergy between us, isn't there? Let's, let's talk about working together. That's not actually... Okay, that was this. Now, we're going to zoom into this here. Okay, so Elastos will explore technological values and applications of blockchains, and it'll become the OS for the blockchain. Uh, and Neo developers, uh, Neo enables developers to create blockchain applications quickly. Okay, this is fine. So there's a new company called Elastos that apparently wants to partner with Neo. Guess what? You see anybody that's familiar to you? You see anybody that's familiar to you? Anybody that's familiar to you? I'm going to zoom out here. This was taken from NASDAQ, okay? All right, so let's zoom out now. Guess what? Let's go to ADEX, okay? Since we're talking about ADEX, and since we're talking about ADEX and NEO, and we're talking about Elastos and NEO, let's look at ADEX and zoom out of ADEX, and guess what? You see anybody look familiar to you? Anybody? Anybody? If you want to... Your mom. Okay, so we covered this screen, we covered this screen, we didn't cover this screen or this screen yet. So let's, but let's some, uh, not quite summarize yet. Let's go here uh, to Princeton University, Princeton EDU, uh, Gregory C. Chow. He sounds Chinese, probably knows what he's talking about. He's in Princeton, he's probably a PhD. Listen to what he says. Gregory C. Chow. Um, <clears throat> more recently, the global economic recession of China's maximum. Uh, have increased the importance of economic planning. We're talking about the importance of central planning here, central planning for the government. Central planning. Do you know what that means? What central planning means is that China doesn't work like America, where Apple and IBM suddenly decide, to, or Apple and Microsoft decide to have this huge fight, or Apple and Samsung America decide to have this huge fight over patents and trademarks and and uh, stealing employees just like uh, Uber and Google had and uh, on their self-driving cars and their technologies and then uh, suddenly the Supreme Court steps in and they decide well this this no that would never happen in China you know what happens in China China tells Apple you develop this China tells Microsoft you develop this this is why China has a version of everything when China decides to do something hey I think Bitcoin is gonna go somewhere uh, let's move into Bitcoin and all these guys in suits in the national parliament, they sit around uh, in the red party and they say, okay, who do we appoint as the lead to decide everything that's going to happen within the blockchain space? Oh, I don't know. Let's just let everyone fight. No, they pick somebody and they tell that somebody to pick everybody else. I'm not saying that the Chinese government picked Jihan Wu. That's not what I'm saying. They probably didn't. Okay. Uh, and that's about all I can say to you. But I can tell you this, the person that they did pick, picked Jihan Wu. Okay, so out of these screens, we only have one screen left. Let's take a look at this screen. Okay, look carefully. These two screens almost look identical. This basically looks like a zoom in of this, right? This, it's just a little bit of a zoom in of this, right? This is this same coin, right? Wrong. 
I'm going to do this so you can see both. You see what I'm saying? This is at x, this is neo. At x, neo. At n, at n. Okay. Let me, let me show you the, uh, this a little closer. Up, down. Up, down. Right? There's a spike and then there's a depression. There's a spike and then there's a depression. And then there's, there's a downward trend and then there's a hump. Downward trend and then there's a hump. Okay? This is the, this is a four hour scale. And then after this hump, there's a spike in NEO, right? There's a spike in ADEX. Now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fast forward to today. I'm going to show you how, how big the spike is in ADEX. BAM! Can you say BAM? Uh, we bought ADEX right here. Uh, we, we actually bought ADEX here and here. Uh, and we bought right when it dipped. There's this huge dip between 24 and 21. So that's a 15% dip. We, we bought the dip again. Uh, which is what I recommend you do right now because let's fast forward NEO BAM and there's a dip see that NEO does exactly actually ADEX does exactly the same thing NEO does so I mean yeah I'm giving you a, a trade secret yes I, I'm giving you an internal trade secret of how we know when ADEX is gonna die or fall or, or do a pump all you have to do is look at what NEO is doing and, oh, by the way, uh, the reason why I'm telling you this trade secret now is that it's over. There is a one, two, three, one, two, three, four candle difference on a four hour scale or was. There was a 16 hour difference between uh, NEO and ADEX. So what happened to NEO 16 hours later happens to ADEX or happened to. Now, they're very synchronized. They're very coordinated. Um, except for the fact that if you look at the RSIs, I'm going to give you a little, there's, there's still a little bit of time, maybe a day or two before people finally figure this out. And then it'll be, it'll be too late for you anyway. RSI, uh, dropped on NEO. RSI is still high on ADEX. So ADEX will still maintain here until it, it, it'll go back up and then drop. So notice the similarities. Notice the similarities. Notice the similarities, notice the similarities, notice the central planning of the Chinese government, a macro, econ macro economic, economic policy. And then finally, if you have over 500 to 1,000 Bitcoins that you want to sell or buy, this is where you do it. Talk to us. We have buyers all over the world for large quantities of Bitcoin and sellers all over the world for large quantities of Bitcoin. And you want, and if you want to actively manage about 200 Bitcoin, uh, over 50 Bitcoin at least, talk to us about fund management. We can, 